Blah. Makes the weirdest sounds. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Sight that's Ann Tigron, and we're already back. That was fast. <laughs> uh, but uh, pretty much so, for those that don't know, uh, a person called Streamers with two M's ended up trying to claim copyright to one of my YouTube videos. Let me get a little bit more light here just for kicks, you know. I'm used to having light in my face because of the webcam and stuff. Um, so it ended up getting to the point where they put up a copyright claim and i mean i like i'm pretty learned in all of this stuff like i actually do a lot of research off camera with game companies and such like that and i noticed like I, i've had this happen before where someone who actually doesn't own the rights to the content that they're trying to claim they own uh, i had it happen once with one of my lego videos and i noticed hmm that company trying to claim my lego videos is not Warner Brothers, so I'm gonna dispute it. And in more more cases than not, you just dispute it once, and then the company will back down and let it go, right? But for these little side troll companies that are just trying to uh, scare other YouTubers and smaller channels like mine and stuff like that into a corner, so that we actually, you know, they threaten with copyright strike and stuff like that, right? So it's like I dispute streamers' claim they reinitialize it. I dispute it again, they reinitialize it one last time and then without warning, I got a copyright strike on my channel and it it completely cripples me. You can't upload videos more than 10 minutes, you can't add annotations, so goodbye to my outros and stuff like that and just a whole pile of other features that it just totally takes away from your account, right? So what I ended up doing was, screw you streamers, I ended up uh, uh, doing the next option, which is rather than me just saying, no, you don't own the rights, it's no, you don't own the rights, and I'm willing to take you to court to prove that you don't own the rights. And pretty much I've been up all night just because I happen to just be up all night. I'm kind of on a night shift right now. And just now, just before this video goes up, I guess whoever streamers is must have woke up and saw the claim, and they actually took down, they canceled their copyright claim to my video uh it is now released and thankfully that's one good thing about youtube being an automated system is the copyright claim on my channel the or not the copyright claim the copyright strike on my channel is now gone it's my account is back in good standing so i wanted to get this video out as soon as possible i actually i'm actually going to bed right after this just to let uh you all know that it's done. It's good. Hopefully, we're not going to deal with this issue anymore ever again. I don't know how, like, apparently one thing that I did learn from this is that, unfortunately, this issue right here where accounts will try to give copyright and stuff is actually very common. So, I really do hope that we don't end up having to deal with anything like that in the future. Uh, I'm also putting this video out as a kind of... Uh, I, I saw another YouTuber actually put a video out similar to this where they actually talked about them dealing with streamers and other more ballsy uh, false accounts that will keep pushing and pushing and pushing and then actually give you a copyright strike. To any other YouTubers that deal with this, just dispute them all the way to the bank because they are not going to risk taking it to court because they are a fake account. There will be links in the description below to anything and everything that I found on the streamers account. Uh, you know, I was, I actually got a lot of really useful info from DMC as well as on the YouTube help forms from another user who I guess had dealt with something similar. And I mean, straight up, like there's a streamers website that has like if you scroll down it actually shows their address is one two three fictional road and stuff like that so they straight up just don't exist but anyway good news that it was able to be dealt with so soon so there's actually not going to be any hit to my videos being uploaded or anything like that so that's good that means that i can get back to work and uh yeah, it's, it's i'm glad that it got over with really quickly and resolved nice and quick and just not much of a headache for me, you know? I still had to deal with it, but at least I only dealt with it for one day rather than like, uh, I think it was like when I put my uh, original contest against them, it was like, this could take 10 business days. And it's like, oh, wow, that's 
10 days that I could potentially not be uploading or anything. But everything's good. Everything's grand. Thank you. I just want to say straight up to everyone that was already like uh, – I know that that video I posted was like just a couple hours ago. But everyone was very supportive. And I just got to say thanks for all of that, everybody. You know, I, I really do appreciate it, especially while I was going through this. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to detox from this a little bit here. But, uh, hey, at least it's cool. Oh, sneak peek, too. This is just a side note. I got that Destiny game everyone's been talking about. So maybe you'll see that on the channel soon. Anyway, that's it. Thank you, everybody. I love you. Sayonara. And... Stay up.